Hello YouTube, welcome back to Real Games. Today I'm going to show you a tutorial on how to upgrade the infinite money farm on Sandbox Tycoon. Now, I recently made a video um, explaining how to make an infinite money farm on Sandbox Tycoon and it was a very small compact design which I think is great but you can make it better. So, the first thing you're going to want to do is make a layout of any block kind of like this so it's a pretty much one block in the middle and then wood three blocks out surrounding it and then there's a one little block here and I'll get onto why we need that in a second but for now just connect all of these like this uh, oh, okay I guess we can keep that doesn't really matter too much <coughs> And then, obviously, we're going to do this as well. Okay, so we have something like this. And if you want, obviously, if you can just make this as well. Um, I don't believe it's too necessary, but we'll do it just because. And the next thing we're going to want to do is, depending on what the rail you have access to, or like the upgrades, like right now I could probably upgrade it, but it doesn't really matter too much. It will just make a slightly faster uh, amount of money, or make money faster, I should say. Uh, but right now I've got 20k and we kind of want to get many things going, or as many things as we can going. So we're just going to go wooden railings. So we'll do this. Just all the way across. And here. And then right here, we're gonna keep the, uh, we're gonna put this here, this, and that. So kind of leave it like that. But for now, we're gonna cover it up. But just remember to mark down where those blocks were for now, just so we remember. So it's like that, okay? And then we're gonna carry on with the rails all the way around. Let's just do this. So this way, and then this way, yep. Like that, turn, and like that, and then I should be facing that way, yep. So now it should be a complete circle, and that's what we need. The next step, uh, get some more wood bricks, or any blocks in particular, and just, and that's not what I wanted to do, and just surround it once again. Just like this. You can get the corner blocks as well if you want, but they're not too necessary, really. Like this. And again, this is just an, uh, an upgrade of my previous video on Sandbox Tycoon about how to make pretty much infinite money and a lot of money compared to just grinding it out. So now we have something like this, <coughs> and this is what we need. So this is great. And the next step is obviously, you know, just to get it started, um, real quickly we're going to grab the uh, one-way collector and just put it right there. So there we go. So now we've got kind of this setup here, and we're going to keep this open for now, because we don't really need it to be closed, and I'm pretty sure we could probably just like, yeah, we can already put it on top. So let's just build two more up, take these away so that we know, or we can even do this, so we know which block to break when it comes to that. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to grab these upgraders and we're just going to start putting them down. Like right here, we'll start here. So that's 9,000. I'm actually going to get rid of this one for now. And um, we're going to start with wooden droppers. So again, this doesn't really matter which one you or like which droppers you use. For me, what I found best is to just use the cheapest dropper available at that point. So obviously the first like many are going to be just wood droppers up until the next one gets to a thousand and then it's going to like a thousand five, a thousand and fifty, then we go stone. If it was me. I don't know why it's not letting me grab the stone ones. It's really strange. That's a really strange. What? Why is this not letting me do it? Hmm.
Does that me grab everything but the stone? Okay, well, sure. Well, I guess for the tutorial, I'm gonna have to show you what it's like just purely out of the wood. Or oh, wrong way. Obviously, we can get more, but clearly, it's kind of being bugged for me. And actually, on top of that, if we're just going to be using these ones, then we can go back to using uh, three upgraders. So again, just get the center. Perfect. And then we can just let this sit. And obviously, you know, there's a 20 dropper like maximum, but this just allows you to get every upgrader and every dropper like possible. So again, with faster, I don't know why it's not letting me use the stone ones. That's like the most efficient way of doing it. So let's respawn. Are we able to use it now? No. It's really strange. Oh well. Anyway, so we've got this set up now. We know which block to break when we do come when it, when it comes to it. And um, yeah, so we're just gonna let this sit for maybe five minutes. And then I'm going to come back and see how much we've made. So I will be back. Okay, so it has officially been five minutes. And um, I think compared to the last video that I did, just for like a starter, I think the basic or like the beginners, what the smaller, more compact version would be good for early stages. But once you start getting higher and higher levels, I think this will be the best. But anyway, let's see how much money we make. So we start at 740. We're going to wait for it all to loop back around and go back in. So we're getting about 60 and 20 per. Which I'd say is pretty good. I'd say it's pretty good. So we've got this long row, I think, left. And then, yeah. So it ends right here. Okay. So we made around about 3,000 from 5 minutes. So I'd say that's pretty good. Um... And obviously, you know, with that, it'd be more efficient if I actually let me use stone droppers as well. But for some reason, it's not letting me do that. So I, I don't know why. Uh, but yeah, again, just do that. Buy some more droppers and just let it go. Yeah. So um, that's the video for you guys. Again, obviously, my recommendations if you wanted to get huge on this game, like... You can see right here, not right there, um, right here, obviously, you know, these people are getting a few, a few hundred every, like, a f I don't know, a few seconds, and I guarantee they're on, like, high level type stuff, like, this guy in here, I don't know what he's doing, this guy, he's got his own little setup, I don't know which person this is, this is yeah no idea um this is george so yeah he's making you know a decent amount as well but he's got all these upgraded droppers he's got the gold dropper and stuff like that by the time we've got to that point and we're getting the uh like we don't even need the gold dropper the things we're focused on changing are the upgraders and even then just go for the cheapest upgraders you can so like we'd get a few wooden but at the end of it if you can afford it my recommendations from start to finish start with the compact video okay the compact build and that's in my previous video on this and um start making your way up to like maybe once you've got about 40 or 50k just from using like the wooden droppers and the stone and uh, st uh wooden stone droppers uh even if you can get some iron droppers in there if they become cheap enough or like the cheapest source uh, the other thing I'd recommend doing is upgrading the rails to either stone or iron. Completely up to you guys. Again, whatever is cheaper. So at this point, once you get into like 50k, you can move from the compact one to the obviously this one. And I, I really recommend doing that just because um, one, you can actually get a 20 droppers in there. And two you can actually like get the five upgraders in and once you could do that just leave it running again for as long as you want make sure to keep jumping every now and then or like moving and checking up on it 
just so that you don't get kicked and all the AFK work goes like away. So yeah, that's just what I recommend. Obviously with this, if I keep going at it and like leave it for maybe an hour, it has like what, 3000 for five minutes of uh, just AFK. So within an hour you'd easily get 30k, like near 50k, which is crazy. And obviously, again, that's with just the basic stuff, the basic wood um, conveyors, the wood rails, the basic and not the cheapest, but the lowest tier of droppers. So everything right now is the lowest it can be. And once we work it up, we could probably be making around 250k every like 10 minutes. So there you go, guys. Here is the new and improved dropper system uh for infinite money on a sandbox tycoon if you guys did enjoy please be sure to smash that like button and subscribe for more video tutorials like this in the future and i'll see you guys later bye